Just west of Cayucas, along the coastline and the Pacific Coast Highway, is a fascinating shipwreck in remarkable condition. The Point Estero was a commercial fishing vessel that had originated from Morro Bay. On July 28, 2017, as it returned to Morro Bay, it ran aground at Estero Bluff State Park, supposedly due to operator error. The U.S. Coast Guard removed all the hazardous materials from the stuck ship. Due to the vessel's location, however, the Coast Guard does not salvage abandoned vessels that are located on land or are semi-grounded on coastal rocks, as their area of authority is navigable waters. Therefore, the Point Estero did not fall under their purview and remained where it was. The owner gave up possession of the boat once it was estimated that it would cost at least $175,000 to remove the boat. Since the vessel is stuck in a state park, the State Lands Commission does have the authority to remove the ship. But due to a legislative oversight by the state, the commission has no funding or budget to actually do so. And thus the boat remains there along the coast and on the Pacific Coast Highway. It has been stripped of everything, including all electronics and engine parts. When the tide is low, it is extremely easy to walk out to the shipwreck in order to board her. For more California weirdness, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much.